What is going on guys? A little alchemist here. It's been a while. Um, Bitcoin is pretty much moving sideways, flirting between, you know, 57,000 and 60s and it's all time highs and Ethereum looking nice and bullish um, at 2,100 just about, 2,100. Um, I have taken some profits from Ethereum. I have like 25% of my portfolio right now in Ethereum. So I'm trying to cut back into 20 so that I could get in smaller low cap um, coins that have uh, more of a chance to increase in percentage. Uh, not to say I'm not bullish on Ethereum. That's just me. I've been into Ethereum since it was at about $400. So... Um, I am very bullish on HBAR and ONE, O-N-E, um, as well as VTHOR. I'm seeing bullish signs on that. I did take profits on Zcash, waiting for a retrace. If there is one, I'll buy more. Um, it's just, I, I've been in Zcash for quite some time, so I just decided to take profits. Um, injective protocol I'm waiting on another week of bullishness before getting in Filecoin um, I am going to buy on the dip it looks like it's retracing and that cake trade is looking good um, if you didn't follow my other videos, I sold some of my Bitcoin, 1% uh, into KSwap so that I could make a higher, faster yield and then re resell into Bitcoin. Um, seeing a W pattern as of today for Tezos, Cosmos, um, in the stock market, OGIG, and uh, MicroStrategy is looking very bullish as well as the copper index, CPER. Um, if, um, Ethereum Classic is looking very bullish. Like I said before, VTHOR is looking bullish. Algorand is looking bullish. One inch is looking bullish. Um, Algo, VTHOR, one inch, all coins I hold. I want to get some more Ethereum Classic because I think it's gonna um, pump uh, Riot. If uh, you know about Riot, it is um, uh, investing in uh, pretty much Bitcoin miners. That is looking quite bullish, uh, as well as an energy web, web token, EWT. I think I'm going to get some of that um, from my Ethereum, Cardano, and Zcash profits. Uh, the reason why I am selling is just I'm seeing some resistance here. Uh, I mean, it could break the resistance. They could continue to rally. And I have sufficient positions in Ethereum and Cardano that I'm fine with. Um, anything that I'm selling right now is just what I feel is excess percentage of my portfolio that I have held in Ethereum and Cardano. So I'm more than happy to sell so that I could start getting myself into position of other coins that have um, upswing potential, such as HBAR and uh, ONE. I keep on calling it one ONE, um, I believe it's Harmony, Harmony. So that is what I'm gonna buy next. HBAR, Harmony, uh, VTHOR, I'm gonna get some more VTHOR as it looks quite bullish. And um, I think Energy Web Token, and if I have any money left, I'll get some Ethereum Classic. But I have a nice amount of Tezos, uh, and that's doing quite well. And so let's see what else I have for you guys. Um, I've been looking into BitClout, which is a social network. Take a look at that. Very, very, very curious. Um, it may be the solution to all of this um, censorship going on in social media. Uh, also, I'm looking into NFTs. I may create one. Uh, I just need the time. 
uh, I'm super busy right now. Uh, creator coins um, such as uh, BNB and uh, Crypto.com are quite bullish. Um, Crypto.com, I have uh, some staked. Um, looks like it is a good time to get in um, as it's kind of consolidating before another breakout, it looks like. Let's see. Uh, so yeah, BitClout, social, social network. Very, very interesting project. Take a look at that if you have some time. Uh, one cool fact about BitClout is that they have between 10 to 19 million um, BitClout coins minted in the long run, which would be less than Bitcoin, which is 21 million. Uh, actually, I believe it's 18 after the supposed, um, you know, lost, uh, an estimated amount of 4 million have been lost. But uh, yeah, one other... Coin I am very bullish on is Rarible, Ferrari. There is talks, whispers going around that it there will be a Coinbase listing for this coin. It's a possible 100x coin out in, in my uh, humble opinion. Uh, yeah, um, let's see what else can give you guys. Um, I mean, the market is bullish all around. Um, I was recently learning about a mortgage blockchain called Figure. Take a look into that. It's going to really change. Um, a lot of things are in the middle of changing. Um, there's a lot of chaos going on around in the world, and it's because everything is evolving and for that to happen, there needs to be um, kind of chaos uh, as these changes take place. Everything is going to be tokenized, it seems. Um, I mentioned in my last video about Mark Cuban talking about how everything is going to be tokenized, and I believe that as well. We're just so very early to this. Um, there's no telling... Um, when we'll begin to see the effects, um, the implementation of these uh, technologies that are taking place. Um, but yeah, if you guys have any questions, feel free to write in the comments. Um, please like, share, and subscribe. I have merch, links below. If you're new to this space, um, what I will tell you is um you know it may get sometimes overwhelming the amount of information that you're taking in there's so much to learn um nobody knows everything that's going on in this blockchain crypto space so don't feel like you're stupid it's not you this is a lot of new information that we have to kind of process um, even I'm struggling with the information fully to grasp how NFTs work. I have an idea, but really it's like your imagination is the limit when it comes to applying, um, these tools that are being developed and presented in front of, uh, us at the moment. But, uh, I'm done babbling. Uh, just wanted to make a quick video. Peace.